Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Big Mooney and today we're going to be doing yet another Hitman episode with your contracts that you've left in the comments section of last week's video. And the most upvoted comment was from Harnam Jandu, and I'm sorry if I butchered your name. I, I, I just... Uh, and also recommended by Rickard Nelson, so I'm taking you at your word wee man, this better be fucking good. But the title is not very discreet, so probably murdering people with loud weapons is how this is going to go, so hopefully it's a good contract and... Uh, well, let's get in and have a wee look at it. Alright, so what's this one got in store for me? This was created using the Hitman Roulette website. This just kind of defeats the point in doing the custom contracts. <laughs> I replaced Hitman Roulette with this series and this is just went full circle again. I, I don't know. Alright, so what we know here is it's going to be on um, Paris and it's going to be killing this random bodyguard. I think this might be the guy that guards Viktor Novikov. I remember him calling him Kurt. So I think he, he must be the guy. We obviously got Sebastian Seto, he's the fashion guy and also the Sheik. So it's um, using three, three weapons that are, um, well it just says sniper rifle and pistol. I'm guessing that I'm supposed to use a loud pistol is what he wanted me to do and it hasn't really specified here, I don't know why. One thing I would like to mention by the way before we get into things, if you're making contracts for the series guys, make sure you don't have it on uh, strict rules where I would need to kill someone specifically the same way that you did. Like if I use a saber, or in this case here, I need to throw the saber in order to kill him with it for it to count. I didn't know that this was an option until last week when I killed the guy with the battle axe and it turned out I had to throw the battle axe at the guy for it to actually count. Which I think is bullshit. Why that's even an option, I, I don't know. But either way, that's the way that it pans out here. So I'll try and stick to exactly what he intended, which is to use a loud pistol and a loud sniper rifle instead of trying to use the silenced ones, because that's just going to be too easy. Because, I mean, if this, I just did this with silenced weapons, I could do this in, like, ten minutes, probably. So let me try and make it interesting, and we'll bring some uh, a pistol to the to the level that you would normally never ever bring. Like, why would you ever bring a, a loud pistol to somewhere? All right, I'm gonna take this thing here, right? It's a loud pistol. It's definitely not something that you should bring into an assassination like this, but that's what I'm gonna try and do. I think I need to kill the Sheik with a sniper rifle. How the fuck am I even gonna do that? All right, we're gonna take the Jaeger 7. I would love to take this thing here, but you know, silencer on there. And I wanna stick to what I said, right? We're gonna take the Lancer. Complete and utter overkill. Okay, I need to bring in a suit. Uh, I need to get myself a stylist and a bodyguard disguise. I can do that, but I need to actually bring in a suit. Let's go blood money suit. Let's take that in there. All right, so here's my setup. This is what I'm going to be going for. Let's get in there and get some shit done. I have, I think, a system in my head for how I want to approach this. Right, so here we are. Looking dapper as fuck. Out in the courtyard here, enjoying the party. It's 47, he, he loves a good fucking party. He always looks so fucking serious. His eyes look like he's seen some shit, honestly. All right, so our first order of business is to uh, get rid of the um, of old Kurt over here. So, yep, it's the guy who I thought it was. Okay, so he's uh, guarding Victor Novikov over there. So uh, that's all right, I know how to sort that out. Just need to get myself in behind here while still wearing a suit, because I do need to kill him while still wearing my suit. I mean, make sure, right, it's a suit and a pistol. Okay, we're, we're good. I'm not gonna go mixing shit up again like I did last week. <laughs> All right. I could probably make my way past really simply over here. Go, 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 go. All right. Sneak my way into here. In fact, there's a guy right there. Probably shouldn't fuck with them. All right, okay, you know what? I'll just go this way. You know, I really should have just used the the basement. The basement would have been so much easier, but apparently this is what I'm doing now. Don't mind me up here, guys. Just scaling the building. Oh, shit, this was not what I wanted to do. Okay, um, okay just cut that. There we are. I honestly find it really hard to believe that no one would see this just happening. I'd like to think if I was guarding a helicopter down there and someone started scaling the building right in front of me, I'd probably notice. I mean, look, he's looking right at me, man, and he doesn't even know. Okay. There is one guy in this room over here. I just had to make the infiltration of the place as dramatic as possible. Right. Now, I need to wait on this bodyguard around the corner moving away. This guy here. He needs to shift for me to have any chance. Oh, fuck it. 
He's gonna get there before me. Shit, there's two guys right there. Ah, fucking. Oh, no, and there's a guy coming through right now. Where are you going? Ah. Why right this very second, man? Keep on walking. Just keep on walking, keep on walking, keep on. Keep on walking. There we go. Just get in there quick. Okay. Okay. Should probably just shut this over. Ah, shit. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna get there in time. Okay, that's fine, whatever. You, down you go, son, just because it's uh, convenient to just do that. Okay. Hmm, how am I gonna do this? All right, well, we'll just use his disguise in the meantime, right? Because I'm not allowed downstairs. I should have just used the basement and went and got myself some a, a fucking disguise right away. Oh, shit, he's going outside. Oh, sorry, mate. Didn't mean that. Right, lads. I need you to fuck off for one second, right? You hen, move. Good shit. Don't mind the tech guy that's poisoning the sushi over here. Right, okay, that's that sorted. But I need to get back in my suit. And I need to get to the fucking bathroom. Like, quickly. Have I got my gun? I do have my gun. Good shit. Alright, okay, so we're in. I've got my suit. The sushi has been poisoned. And that is not, like, speaking in code or nothing. Mate, I need you to go away. Like, now. Mate. Mate, could you go away? Are you done here? You're supposed to walk away at some point. Right, well, you can go over there. Just go over there, mate. Go over there. Just walk. I don't like the look of that. Someone should go see. All right already. Hey, it wasn't me. <laughs> don't mind me, lads. I'm just going in this bathroom. And I'm just going to hide here for one second. I'm in the wrong bathroom. Right. Right, right. This has... See this, right? See that problem? That needs to be fixed. It completely defeats the whole game because of it. Now, if I kill this guy right now, will it matter? Will I still be counted as spotted? Because I honestly don't know at this stage. I don't know if I should just start again because... Well, it's, it's bullshit. Whatever, I'll just execute the cunt, right? This is how we do it, right? Pull him up here. Need to put on my disguise, remember, my, my, my suit first. And then we do this. Okay. Heard that too. Let's pull him out. Right, okay, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Yeah. There we go. There we are. They went into the wrong bathroom. <laughs> they searched the wrong fucking place. <laughs> Wow, that's some good guards for you right there. <laughs> I like how I brought a pistol into the, the level just to use the own his pistol on himself. They've give they've given up already. They have actually given up already. Wow. Good job there guys. You never even ran into the right bathroom. <laughs> but it's fine. Alright, okay, so the only guy that does see me is dead now, but I don't know if the game's gonna count that as me being spotted, even though I just snuck up behind him perfectly and it just decided to um be a dick about it. Again. So brilliant. Okay, until next order of business. Who goes down using the bodyguard suit? Okay, so it's you and I need to use my sniper rifle. So let's go out and actually get that. Right. Now, because it's not on professional mode, no one cares that I'm just walking around with this massive overkill fucking sniper rifle. Okay, so Sato is downstairs and the Sheik is there? Is he all- oh, oh shit. Is he already- he's already actually at the auction, so this complicates things a wee bit. <laughs> I don't know if he goes back downstairs again after he's already been up to the auction. Because again, it's much easier to just shoot someone and then hide them, like right away, in their own private room rather than, well, whatever I'm gonna do now, I honestly don't know. <laughs> Alright, pal, don't you hey, what about me? Get down from there. What? Fuck it. Whoa! I don't think he's loaded that guy's face yet. <laughs> Jesus. Alright, okay, so he is right there. I don't wanna just assassinate him right in the middle of the room with a sniper rifle. I don't know what he do. Do I, do, do I wait on him? Does he at any point does he actually leave? What if I bump into you? What if I just if I just do this, if I just, will you move if I just do this, mate, can you just do, can you move, can you, mate, 
Mate, you're a, you're in my seat there, pal. Can you? I'll just I'll, I'm guarding the sheet, lads. Don't worry, I'm keeping them nice and fucking safe. If he would like at any point to actually move, it would be nice. Yeah, mate. Uh, yeah, mate, mate, mate. I mean, I can't sell an assassin if he's in the middle of a fucking crowded room. It's just not possible to kill someone with a sniper rifle in the middle of a crowded room and get a fucking silent assassin rating for it. So... So what now then? I guess I just try and get away with the sniper shot itself. Ah shit, this conversation goes on for ages and I was wanting to use this room. Hmm, maybe the other side's better. I think the other side might be better. Don't mind me guys, I'm just scouting the place out a wee bit. Make sure there's no uh, okay? weak, weak points. Yeah, everything's fantastic. Right, you... They're gonna find a body anyway once I shoot them, so you go down now, son. There we are. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, now. Where is he? It's hard to see through this glass. Okay, that does not make it easier. Eh. Uh, have I got a clean shot? I can't even tell. He's like right there, but there's a guy's head in the way. <laughs> and then when I move to the side, there's a curtain in the way. Shit. Now let me try this. Like I've got like a wee square inch of uh, space here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Get off the... Okay. Hold on. Hold on, I'm just... Eh. Uh... Okay, go quick, go quick, go quick, go quick. Go quick, get around this corner. Ah oh, shit, that's it, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked, I'm fucked. Don't mind me over here, mate, I'm just... 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 <laughs> what? Okay, and... Down, and I no longer own this uh, sniper rifle, so it's okay. <laughs> I kinda, kinda jumped slightly there because, uh... I forgot that I was using, like, the world's loudest and most powerful fucking sniper rifle. <laughs> hey, are you leaving now? Oh, good thing I don't walk out there, man. Okay. Alright. Let me just keep on walking. And, uh, last order of business in is just getting the stylist disguise and then throwing a saber at this man's head. Sounds like a piece of piss. What do you think, lads? I'm sure everyone in that party fucking shat themselves there when the guy got vaporised in the middle of the fucking room. <laughs> Especially when considering I shot him with that rifle from about, what, about 15 feet away? Something like that? <laughs> I didn't see the aftermath of it, but I'm pretty sure he's probably in pieces. Either that or he's like, basically turned just into vapour. Right, I know that there's a, a disguise for the stylist somewhere around about here. But it's one of those disguises that I just don't bother with usually because, well, why would you? It's kind of shit, to be honest. There is this one guy here that I could probably lure away if I can't find myself my own disguise. Cause I think there's a loose one just sitting somewhere that I could get changed into. If only I could find it. Oh, you know what? There's a stylist down here. I just remembered. I mean, it's probably easier to just get this guy's disguise when he's having a munch down here, so... Right, no, right, there he is, there he is there. Right, just need to wait on this security guard fucking off. Right, as soon as he's out of the picture then that makes this a little bit easier. Right, just you, you move. Subdue! There they are, right, there it is, there it is, there it is, there it is. Don't you turn your head there, me man. What was that random flash? What the fuck was that? Yeah. Right, okay, we're, we're done. Right, okay, done, 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 done. Go, 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 go. <laughs> I could just leave him like that and no one would even notice. <laughs> he's just, he's just trying to say whether or not he wants to eat those green beans. Oh, fuck, he's stuck in the chair. Oh, shit. Right, come on, mate. Come on, we don't have all day for this shit. Okay, okay. There we go. Whoa, kind of fell over into the box. That was kind of weird. All right. There we go. So I need to get myself some poison, I think, in the next room. I forget why. Who am I killing again? Oh yeah, Sato. Yeah, we do. We do. <laughs> Short term memory. Okay, so I need a saber. And we need Sato to, to just move a little bit. Alright. So I think what's probably the right thing to do is right now I could probably... Oh, you know what? I'm forgetting one thing. I'm forgetting one, one part of this plan. Right, so I have the disguise that I need to kill Sato, but I don't have the right disguise to get him into the state that I need to kill him. So, 
basically, I need to poison them. And to do that, I need to get myself a, a waiter disguise, because otherwise everyone just instantly sees through your disguise the second that you try and poison them. So now I need to run all the way up, poison this drink, and run all the way back. Oh, how fun Hitman is sometimes. <laughs> so I go up and around here, then it should just lead me right into the, the room where he is. In fact, I think I might need to even juggle around a couple of disguises to get all this to work. Right, rat poison. There we are. Now, you won't drink that until I make him do it, so it's not a problem at the moment. It's just, you know, sitting there casually poisoned. Although, I probably don't even need to do that part of it. Is he on stage right now? Are you fucking kidding me? Bodyguard suit back on again. Should have probably did this when I was walking around earlier on, but I didn't, so... Now we need to go and do this. Right, so we go in okay? here. Yeah, everything's fucking rosy, pal. We need to get ourselves a saber. Eh. Uh, and someone's decided now is the time for fucking hoovering. Right, oh, brilliant. Fucking fantastic. I love my new house. My new house has been so... perfect and good for recording all the time. Ah, they've went to... to Hoover the other side of the, the mansion. Right. Okay, so I need into into this over here. Fuck it. Let's do it. Do it. We good? No one even noticed. <laughs> You'd think someone would notice something like that. But no. No, they haven't. Oh, he's back. I really hope he still does the same things now that now that I've set this up. I'm hoping he's still in, in the same loop. Oh shit, there's Novakov. All the pieces are in place, finally. There's no bear fucking hoovering happening, which is always great for recording purposes, you know. Now what's he doing, right? I need to throw the sword. Remember that. Need to throw it. Right, 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 right. Where is he? Where are you going, man? What? Where's he off to? I'm not allowed in here, apparently. I didn't know that. Okay. I've never actually seen that. Like that before. Shit. Helmet Kruger's just standing up there. So now apparently I have to get him with the sword in here. Oh shit. I had a plan. I had it all set up. And now he's mingling in the party. I like how he's meant to be the big star of the show when no one even pays any attention to him. <laughs> I hate this song, by the way. I've heard it so many times. <laughs> right. Hey there, Mr. Stylist. Mate, could you, you could you just go and isolate yourself again, please? Just go back. To <laughs> just balding his way right through. Right, lads. Since you seem to be pushovers, I'm just going to push my way through as well. What is Sato even doing at this stage? He's just randomly wandering around. I really hope this isn't like the end of his loop, and that's all he does is walk around here now. That would be really fucking irritating if that's the case. Okay, where's he going? Where's he going? Please walk back round to your... to your place again. There's no way I'm gonna be able to get him in this room. If he's just gonna go on a small loop of this room now, then well, what do I do now? I took way too long in getting everything set up. Shit. Yeah, he's just gonna go back outside again, isn't he? How the fuck am I gonna do this? You know what? They've already seen one person. I've got an idea. Watch this. When I'm away setting this up, he'll go back to his fucking original... Routine again. How many times am I gonna be going up and down these fucking stairs? Is he still out there? I think. Yeah, I think he's still. He's. I think he's just went on a small loop around that party area of the place now. So I. I need to. Um. I need to improvise. Yeah, like most of this place is emptied out at this stage. Right. Pick up the saber. I've made this last so much longer than it really should have done. <laughs> just because. Oh yeah, I forgot about this guy. I don't want to get recorded by cameras. Come on, get around the camera, get around the camera, get around the camera, go, 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 Oh, It just caught me on the side of it there. Fuck, I need to go deal with that now, and I don't have any silenced weaponry. Would I be able to do this? Oh, I totally would, wouldn't I? Although, mate, you've trapped- Now you've trapped me in a corner. How would I get rid of this guy? Does a fire poker kill them? I really don't know, and I don't want to test it out right now. <laughs> okay, so I need to get rid of both of these guys. He's about to turn around in a second, so I don't want to- do it right this very second. There we go. He's spinning around. I need to clear out this room for this to work. If it's going to work. Okay, he's down, 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 he's down. Right, okay. Go quick. Quick, 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 quick. Hey, there we go. Now, I don't know if anyone else comes out of this bloody room as well, but just in case they do, let's try and find a cupboard for them. There we are. Nice empty cupboard for you. I have a sneaky suspicion someone else does come up here. Right, okay. 
Room is clear. For now. Right, so the sword is upstairs. Now I just need to go and get my bloody outfit again. <laughs> and deal with the security cameras. That is something that does need to be dealt with. Okay, now I'm actually officially trespassing, so that's no ideal. <laughs> Yeah, need to wait on these two guards fucking off first before I can go anywhere. I just need to get past them, and I'll be sorted. Is that the music from the game? Yeah, there's some dramatic shit going on. What even is going on? What the fuck even is that? <laughs> I don't like this guy being over there as well. That just, there we go, right. Okay, I can just... Zoom on by, zoom on by, zoom on by. There we are, right. I'd say that was successfully done. Now it's just the case I have my sword, I have my disguise, and I have my target in my sights. So, Seto. Right, okay. Yes, I got him! <laughs> I actually got him. Compromised, though. What's this bullshit? Why am I compromised? And hunted? The fuck? I don't get it. Oh, they're all gonna... They're all gonna find this disguise. Right, well, we're gonna use this disguise. And get downstairs. <laughs> and just get out of here as quickly as possible. I could have silent assassined this bloody contract if it wasn't for the fact that I took so long to get everything in place that he moved into just... An impossible spot, there was really not much I could do. I got quite lucky I was even able to kill him for fuck's sake. Now, I don't know why I was compromised there at the end, but whatever man. All people saw was that sword flying through the sky and right into his fucking skull. Took a bit of a gamble there as well though, and, and whether or not it was even him that I was throwing it at, but fortunately for me it was. So yeah, we, we got that done. I got 31,000 points and it took me 33 minutes. <laughs> oh, it took so long. I got all the... I got every single thing though. The only reason I got such a low score is because I tried to do every single thing. But hey, I, I did it. Not, not particularly well. Let's see how other people did. Yeah, we've got people doing it in three minutes at fucking like 84,000 points and shit. And then there's me in fourth, but miles and miles behind third. <laughs> Uh, may have another crack at this off camera just to sort of see if I can get a better score. <laughs> but I feel like that was an interesting way to go about it. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to submit your own contracts and uh, upvote other people's contracts that are good in the comment section down below, then don't forget, get involved down there. And I think this series um, gives a good platform for some of you guys to find some interesting contracts yourself, not just for me to play. But also, for you guys, you can just jump through the comment section. There's going to be people's best efforts at trying to make a good contract. So, probably find something interesting if you just scour the comment section if you're looking for any levels to play. But if you want to contribute, then please, please submit your uh, contract codes and IDs and all that good shit down in the comments. And, uh, and I'll have a wee swatch next week to see which ones are good. And remember, upvote the ones that are good, just so I know what ones are going to make a good video. But yeah, until next time, I've been Big Mooney and I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Sir, enjoy the show.
Man, I wish I had that job. <laughs> 